Adopt Me's new egg has been confirmed. The brand new egg inside of Adopt Me has actually been leaked. And when I say leaked, I mean Adopt Me deliberately posted this. But they try to keep it a little bit of a secret. Whenever Adopt Me goes and posts a new egg, they always go and leak it in the exact same location. For example, this was the leak for the danger egg, where in the toy shop they had all of this lava and these red spikes inside of a moon. The leak for the mythical egg was all of these mythical crystals, again, inside of the the moon. I think you get where we're going here. Because the leak for the urban egg was also the exact same thing. It was a city inside of the moon featuring different bin bags, buildings, and stop signs. And while well, Adopt Me has actually gone and removed the urban egg one and replaced it with something new. Adobe did also recently announce that now is the time to go and get the pets that you want out of the urban egg, hinting towards the fact that this egg is going to be leaving the game. Plus, the egg has been around for an average of about four months, which is typically the duration that an egg lasts in Adopt Me. So let's actually go to the exact location where Adopt Me always goes and leaks the brand new egg. You see, they don't officially announce this for a little while, and they try to keep this a bit of a secret that if you stumble across it, then you know that that's what the next egg is going to be. And of course, by the title of the video, you can probably predict what the egg is. Why did I go in the pizza shop? I am so dumb. So of course, you need to go and head inside of the toy shop if you've somehow never actually checked this out, then I recommend going and doing it. For it, you can either walk up the ladder, or if I was you, I would recommend trying to go and get a fly pet, or even just a propeller or a grappling hook would actually work pretty well. So I'm gonna go and use the propeller as I feel like this works pretty well and what you want to do is follow the shape of the rocket and after the rocket you will see the moon if it lets me jump up. So of course you will know by the fact of the video's title and the thumbnail that the new theme is a desert which is actually really interesting. So many players have been asking for this exact update for a very long time. Now the question is, what sort of pets would we actually get out of a desert-themed egg? That's if it even is called a desert-themed egg. It could be a location egg instead of a theme. So it could be something like an Egyptian egg or a Middle East egg. Just some type of egg that obviously relates to sand and cactuses, which is typically associated with the desert. Now what we have here is what looks like a pharaoh or a sphinx. If you don't know what either of those things are, a sphinx is basically a cat made out of like sand <laughs> and it looks like this. Now I have a feeling that if there is going to be a legendary out of this egg, there would definitely be a sphinx as the legendary pet as that would logically make sense since they were literally seen as gods based in the time of when these things were created. As for the other pets, we could get things such as ostriches, lizards, vultures, camels, literally whatever you think you would find inside of a desert, you would most likely find inside of this egg. Lots of other people think that the pets that you might get out of this egg are things such as crabs or pyramid themed pets. I mean, a dummy is literally known for adding some completely random pets and considering there is pyramids in the background, they might add that. Or if they are extremely bored and want to have a bit of fun, they could literally turn a cactus into a pet. I really wouldn't put them past. Since Adopt Me literally has a candle as a pet, I don't see why they wouldn't add a cactus as a pet, to be honest. Obviously, there already is a cactus or desert theme inside of Adopt Me. If you haven't gone and witnessed that before, then when you go and head on over to the gifts display and have a look at the theming, you will see that in three days, we get a desert and then again in 34 days we get a desert you see it's not typical for a dummy to go and have the same theming twice in one month which is definitely odd typically it would be the desert and then it would be like the icy one and i'm pretty sure in the desert you get the scarabs is that how you get the different types of scarabs i believe so let me search scarab yeah this is the giant gold scarab you can get this out of the desert location and this is the robux pet and you get and there's also the giant black scarab i have 41 of these so if you guys do want a giant black scarab let me know in the comments and i'll actually go and give away some of these completely for free because realistically i really don't need that many i guess i opened 100 when they originally came out or something as for the design of these eggs honestly I'm not too sure, but I've made some concepts myself. 
Using a bit of AI, I was able to go and design what I thought these would go and look like. I basically told the AI to go and have an egg featuring like these pharaoh aspects, like a golden helmet. And then the AI basically creates it for me, showing me what I exactly wanted. I think this one is my personal favorite. This dude just looks very happy. It's got like a little pharaoh's headband and uh, it just looks really cool. So let me know what you think the egg is going to look like. Obviously, there is a chance that it might not have like a pharaoh's outfit on. It could have like a cowboy hat or it could just be sandy colored or it could be literally anything like this one This one's funny. It's just just an angry egg. I don't really know what that one is This one's like a, a palm tree pineapple. I I don't know I guess people like eating pineapples in the desert makes sense if you're hungry and yeah There's a lot of fun different like little egg concepts this one's got a cowboy hat. This one has got like cactuses on it, like painted. So there's definitely like a lot of interesting ways that Adopt Me could go and design this new egg. This one just looks like it's it's chilling in the middle of the desert, looking like it's having the time of its life, that little dude. So yeah, I wonder what the egg is actually gonna look like. Could it look like this? Just uh, an egg locked up in chains. Honestly, I'm very much intrigued what it's going to be this um clearly does not say desert um which is which is great ai is not capable enough of knowing how to spell desert yet apparently as for the release date of this update adopt me typically goes and waits like a month after they've gone and leaked it to then go and actually have the egg in the game. Now what I'm hoping for is that Adopt Me will go and do something similar to the Fossil Isles event. I know we've said that like a million times, but it's literally one of my favorite egg updates and logically it would make so much sense if they did some type of like sand reveal for each pet and day by day they released it rather than just saying, hey, the egg's leaving, uh, here's a new one. It would definitely make it more fun, get a ton more players, and definitely what Adopt Me needs to go and do for the future egg releases, instead of just going and making them, hey, the egg's gone, here's the new pets. I think definitely going and having an event like that would logically make sense. Let me know what pets you'd like to see coming out of the desert egg, if that's what it's going to be officially called. Let us know in the comments what you think it's going to be and when it will release. I'll let you all know if you subscribe and turn on notifications to find out. Did you know that I have my own website where you can purchase my merchandise? Say you want to have a really cool hat with an embroidered tiger on it eating a cookie, or a hat that literally says neon on it to go and show you your love for neon pets. I even have a mouse pad for when you're playing Roblox or even a backpack and iPhone cases. Now some of these items do sell out so be sure to go and check out my website before it all sells out. The website is madebycookie.com. You need to watch me make all of the new Aussie pets mega neon in Adopt Me. I think you'll love this video. Click here right now to go and watch it. I make all of them mega neon and I think you'll be very intrigued to see.